Somebody else. Over here? No? Over here? In the hat. Oh, um, oh in the hat in the back first. Um, you, uh, you make some pretty obvious references in the character of Malcolm Reynolds after the character of Firefly. Yep. You said uh, last year that you named the character of Monk after the guy in the... Doc, Doc Savage, stories. yep. Are there any other references that are a little more subtle that... Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in this book especially, there's some Easter eggs in here. Uh, and there's going to be contests associated with one of these. My critique group didn't even figure this one out. I even questioned them. Do you know who this is? No, who is it? It's so-and-so. Oh my God, I can't believe it. So, don't tell anybody. There's a contest, you're not allowed to vote. So yes, there, are, there is uh, some, some Easter eggs buried in there, certain things. And a lot of people ask me, you know, oh, please put me in your book, please put me in your book. And I said, I'm glad to put you in my book, but I get to kill you in some horrible, horrible, horrible <laughs> ways. So. And we're running a contest right now. I'm wearing my one of the Sigma Force logo uh, gear here. Uh, it's a, a fundraiser for the um, uh, Humane Society. All profits go to the Humane Society if you, if you get to, to Cafe Press and, and order some of our logo gear. We're running a contest through July. Anybody who uses the logo gear in the most creative manner, uh, at the end of July, we're going to select who did it in the most, you know, whether you put bullet holes in it, hopefully not while you're wearing it, uh, you know, put weird writing on it, something that, that impresses me enough. We'll have a, a, in, a very informal, you know, this one's the best. And whoever it is has the most creative use of that of logo gear gets to be put in one of my books. So it's a little extra incentive. <laughs>